Well, here's my next project. I just picked up a sailboat. It's on my bucket list to learn how to sail. So, uh, this is a 80s model McGregor. And apparently it's all here. Uh, I haven't worked through the thing yet, but um, got a good trailer. Put new tires on it just to get it home. And apparently the mast and rigging, everything is all connected. It sailed probably, I don't know, I think the guy said 10, 15 years ago, something like that. Yeah, it even comes with a surfboard. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that since I don't live near the ocean. But it's uh, got a little cabin in there, got a little sink, fridge, table, V-berth. It's full of junk right now, so I can't show it to you, but it's uh, it needs some good polishing up, fix the cracks eventually. I'm gonna probably throw it in the water as soon as I figure out how to get this mast up. And we're gonna see if it floats. I'm sure it will. The hull is in good shape. You can see there's there's no holes. A little ding at the um, the keel, but other than that, um, it's got a busted u-bolt right there on the trailer but uh, a little bit of rust came from central california so um, but it's got a good solid trailer good bunks gotta throw new lights on it uh, but it came with a motor here's a nissan five horsepower motor looks like it's in pretty good shape it's got compression so guy says it ran so i don't know we'll see but you know it's a good little motor it's got a really heavy duty bracket here for putting the motor further down in the water and uh, a little storage area here for anchors and whatnot there's a place underneath each bench for sleeping, and then of course the V-berth. So, it's got a top that goes up here, like this, once you get the mast off the thing. The top raises up, gives you more headroom, and you've got a roof that slides back and forth. Windows seem to be in okay shape. I'll probably replace those eventually. But, uh, All in all, it's in not too bad a condition. So, I guess this, uh, this old guy is gonna learn how to sail.